Who are my PWBA fans, the Pro Women's Bowling Association Tour fans? I'm a huge one. So if you know me at all, you know that I love sports, but there's two seasons in particular that I really look forward to, and that is PWBA season kicking off, which happens in just a few days, guys, and also MLB. I'm a huge baseball fan. So I want to know if you are too, and I want to share some information on how you can watch this season and my experience of seeing the ladies in person a couple years ago, which was super fun. I'm going to share all that coming up next. Stay tuned. Okay, guys, so it's no secret. I love bowling. That's why I have this channel. I love coaching. I love promoting the sport of bowling. And one of the things as a fan that I look so forward to is the women's season kicking off. I follow them on social media. I met some of them in person when I went to one of the tour stops in 2019. This is the one in Louisville, Kentucky, that Dasha Kovalova shot her 300 game to win the whole thing. It was amazing. I want to talk about that. And I encourage you guys, if you've never watched any of the pro tour, of course, the PBA guys are awesome. And we've been talking about that. But now it's the ladies' turn to kick off their season their season runs for a few months from May through the beginning, middle part of August, and it's exciting. There's so much, and I love to support them. I love to watch them on BowlTV.com. Have you guys gotten your subscription to that? I started to watch Bowl TV a few years ago, and it is an amazing broadcast, I think, because the commentators are always really knowledgeable. Everybody's so polite, right? You know, you find all the stuff on the internet that's not always so polite, and that's a really positive community to be a part of. There's a really positive chat. You can win cool things like this t-shirt. I was told that there's a new version of the t-shirt coming out for this season. They give it away a lot, and you can win that. I also won these Sony wireless headphones. They do ball giveaways. They do so much, so it is a really great place to be. So be sure to check that out. In 2019, I had the opportunity to drive to Louisville, Kentucky. Because I was part of the Bull TV community, I instantly had friends there. It was so much fun to meet up with people that I had met through the chat. It was just a positive place. I also got this VIP ticket to sit right behind the players when they had their TV broadcast. So as you can see here, I met so many of the wonderful players. And I will say that these women are down to earth. They enjoy talking to the fans. They enjoyed signing autographs. I bought this book for, I think it was $5. And it has their, their, their tour book that year and in the back there was a place for autographs so I got a lot of autographs. One of the ladies that I bowled the Pro-Am with, which is Bowl with the Pros, you do it the night before, that was so much fun. I got to bowl with Diana Zavialova and I happened to be just sitting around after the set was done the next day and she happened to be walking through and she said, here, do you want a ball? And she just gave me her heat lava ball <laughs> and she signed it. I'm sorry to say that the signature has faded over the last couple of years, but this is something that I really treasure that I got from Diana. So when I bowled the Pro-Am, I bowled with some of the pros. I got to bowl with not only Diana Zavialova, but I also bowled with Birgit Poplar. She has a new name now, Birgit Norweeks. I think I'm pronouncing that correctly. And I also got to bowl with Shannon O'Keefe and it was so much fun bowling with these ladies. You got to watch all the game action. And in the finals was Missy Parkin, Maria Jose Rodriguez, Birgit Poplar, now Birgit Norweeks, Liz Johnson, and Dasha Kovalova, who shot her 300 game on TV. It was amazing to watch. Her mom was in the stands. I happened to be in the parking lot getting ready to drive home when she came out of the building and all the girls dumped, I don't know if it was water or some other drink, <laughs> all over her to celebrate. It was really, really, really fun. And you got to see the camaraderie between the players. So if you have the opportunity opportunity to go see the ladies in person, I highly recommend doing that. So that's what I wanted to share with you guys. I cannot wait for the PWBA season to kick off. I want to hear from you. If you have a favorite player that you'd like to cheer on, if you're already a member of the Bull TV community, I'd love to hear from you. There's a really great Facebook group that you could join as well. I just want to wish all the women that are bowling in the PWBA this season the best of luck. We are cheering you on. Good luck. Support your bowlers, guys. If you got something from this video, please like the video and don't forget to subscribe so you don't miss bowling videos and tips that I drop in the future. You can always hit that bell icon so it'll notify you every time that I do. Thanks for watching, everyone. See you next time.